internet exploded with controversy last month surrounding a guy on Twitter who goes by the name of Ty. So Ty was listening to his voice messages one day when he came across this unexpected message. Alpha, Uniform, Tango, India, Oscar, Uniform, Sierra, Tango, Hotel, Echo, Yankee, Alpha, Romeo, Echo, November, Oscar, Tango, Hotel, Uniform, Mike, Alpha, November, 0429339642330, Sierra, Oscar, Sierra, Delta, Alpha, November, Gall, Echo, Romeo, Sierra, Oscar, Sierra. Many believe that what you just heard are a grouping of words relating to the NATO phonetic alphabet. This is something that is used in military terms. If you've ever seen any military movies or anything like that, then you know what this is. Up until this point, it was assumed that these were just random words sent to Ty's phone. Ty has been working on decoding the message and posting what he's been finding to his Twitter page. What he found is so chilling, it will astonish you. After he posted the voicemail live on Twitter, an unknown user from Malaysia told him to remove the tweet. When I tried to search the username, it did pop up, but it just showed that the user had been restricted due to unusual behavior, which is even more odd and creepy to me. Like, So Ty states on his Twitter that just a few days before he got the voicemail, he was sitting in front of his house outside in the car on his phone at 3 a.m. in the morning when a man walked up to his house and started taking photos with a flash. Why would they be contacting him all the way from Malaysia? Like, what does this have to do with anything? What does this connect to? It's just so, so unbelievably bizarre. I don't even know where to begin. This is just the most bizarre story ever. Reddit has been all over this case from day one. So if you guys would like to read more about what they discovered, I will leave a link in the description bar down below for you guys to check out. Few people have also noted that the voicemail coordinates also correspond with the area of the Malaysian Flight 370, which if you guys remember, disappeared off the face of the earth back in March of 2014. The aircraft was flying from Malaysia to Beijing, China when it disappeared. Few believe that this could possibly be coming from the missing black box of that plane. Now get this guys, if you Google the numbers in a string, it leads to a DNA genome strand and test data. Someone else noted that there is an S sound right before danger, which means the message is on a continuous loop. It is not a message set to play once, it goes to voicemail. A black box records the last interaction with the plane. So could this be the missing black box of flight number 370? There's also a theory floating around that these messages are directly related to Stephen Hawking's death. Stephen Hawking was an incredible scientist bound by a wheelchair. He's particularly known for his discoveries and research into black holes. He also has some really interesting theories surrounding life forms on other planets. Stephen Hawking died on March 14th of this year. They don't have an exact time of when he passed away, but is believed to be early morning that day. Early morning March 14th, London would be late night March 13th here in America. Ty received the voicemail March 13th at 12.28 a.m. and he posted it at 12.50 a.m. That would have been a couple hours just before Stephen Hawking's death. So could this possibly be a message from Stephen Hawking before his death sent to Ty's phone to warn us about the future? Or could this be from the missing black box of flight number 370 that was supposed to make it to Beijing China from Malaysia but never did. Guys, either way, this is absolutely and entirely bizarre. Whether it is the missing a black box or whether it is Stephen Hawking sending this message before he died, the entire thing is just so creepy and bizarre. I honestly do not have any words here like I'm still trying to figure it out myself I'm still digesting it I'm still researching it I, I I have no idea all I can tell you is the theories that other people have come up with and the more theories I hear the more bizarre it gets and the just the crazier it gets what do you guys think let me know in the comments down below as always feel free to share these videos don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you don't want to miss out on any of my future episodes and i will see you guys next week
Bye.